Hey everyone, and welcome to the course. This is Economics of Labor Markets, Temple University, Summer 2002, sorry, 2020, long day. Uh, I am Professor Shin, I'm the instructor for this course. And the goal of this video is to give you a broad overview of the course, run you through everything in the course, um, show you where you can find everything, um, because as you hopefully already know, this course is being administered entirely online and everything you're in need can be found on the Canvas website. And so I'm going to take you through everything and hopefully give you, kind of point you in the directions that you're going to need for everything and um, be good to go for the semester. So let's dive right into it. So here we have the, can the main Canvas website here and for the course page. And we have the course overview and information section, which is the intro video you're watching, the syllabus, um, and then a voice thread tutorial, which I'll talk about in a second. So if you click on the syllabus, you can have the syllabus for the course, and you can download it by clicking on the link here, which will open up here. So again, this is economics, the labor markets. Here's the course information, my contact information. Um, just to give you a little bit of background on me, I have been teaching at Temple and a couple other places since 2010. Um, I've taught labor economics, health economics, micro and macro, sports economics, um, and a couple other courses here and there, but those are my main ones. Uh, that's my part-time job. Full-time, I work for the government. I am an economist with the Department of Housing and Urban Development out of the Philadelphia office. And as far as getting in contact with me, email will be the best way. Um, Joseph.shin at temple.edu is my email. That's the best way to get into contact with me. Uh, I'm usually able to respond within 12 to 24 hours, if not sooner. Office hours with the university still pretty much shut down and with this being an online course, um, I will have office hours on Zoom, and but they will be by appointment only. So if you need to set up a time with me, just reach out through email, let me know, and we'll work something out. Prerequisites are here. Uh, the required textbook is Modern Labor Economics, 13th edition. It's a really good book. Um, it's what we're going to be kind of following along with that pretty good. Course description is listed here. Web access. So this course again is going to be done entirely online and on Can the Canvas website you're going to find all assignments, lectures, links to outside work um, and you're responsible for keeping up with all the assignments and asking questions if you have any. Right. Now that's I can't emphasize that enough because it's, a lot of times what happens is people struggle because they don't understand something early and then they um, just never kind of get back to it um, and then you know they get tripped up later and there are issues. Um, so if you have any questions make sure you ask. Each week for this course for the mo with the exception of the first one runs from Saturday through Friday and the first week is going to run from Tuesday through the following Friday um, because it's kind of a short week so I extended it just to basically a week and a half. Uh, the materials are going to be given during that week. They're only going to become available one week before that week starts. Um, so you can look a little bit ahead but you need to make sure you keep an eye on the due dates. The course grade breakdown is here. So the discussions. During almost every week, there are going to be discussions done through the VoiceThread website. You will be given a topic and you're to post, make two posts during the week. They can either be voice or video. By the end of the day, Monday, so sometime between Saturday and Monday, you're to come see the topic and post one original comment on that topic. And then sometime between Tuesday and Friday, you're to come back listen to posts made by other students, and then directly respond to one of those posts. 
you can agree, disagree, um, expand on, whatever. Just make sure you're, just, you're respectful. Each post should be 30 to 60 seconds and be an original thought. Here's the breakdown of the grading for the voice led assignments. Quizzes. Um, there's a quiz given most weeks and it's going to cover what's covered during that week. Uh, if you don't, if you miss a quiz, you get a zero for it. Um, but the lowest quiz grade does get dropped at the end of the semester. All quizzes are administered in Canvas. They're multiple choice. Uh, but there is a time limit of 30 minutes. And so once you start, you have 30 minutes to complete it. If you start it and then have some sort of technical issues, just make sure you email me right away. Uh, the exam, there's only one exam for this course, given the last week. Um, there is, however, no time limit. Um, you're to come, you can come at any time. You can open it up. Um, then you're to do your responses in a Word document, and then just attach it. You can use the open, you know, use the book, notes, internet, whatever. You just cannot work with other students. Uh, here's the disability statement. Um, if you need any special accommodations, the information is here. Statement on academic freedom. Basically, don't cheat. Um, you do these, these courses to be done on your own. The, and then here is our, the breakdown. So each week runs from Saturday through Friday, with the exception of the first week, which again runs from Tuesday the 23rd through Friday, July 4th. Um, within each week, you have your assignments, the voice thread discussions, and the quizzes, and so forth. So if we go back into Canvas, Again, we have the syllabus, there's a voice thread tutorial, um, but I'll show you how to do that, how to post a comment, but this is just another place to look. So for each week, you have the dates, and then you have a overview and assignments. And so for each week, you're going to have the learning goals, the assigned readings, uh, the quizzes that you're going to have due, which can be found here, or I'll show you somewhere else in a second and the voice thread discussions. So let me show you one of these. Once you go into the actual discussion, you'll be given the topic, um, and then you'll see everyone who's already made posts over in the left-hand side here. To make a post, you can click on the little plus sign, and you can do either voice uh, or video. And Once you make that, you'll get the option to view it and save it or record it again. If you want to directly respond to somebody else's, if you click on their comment, you can click this little icon here, and that'll just show a direct response to it. It'll be kind of a threaded um, thing in there. And again, if you have any questions, there's another tutorial here that kind of shows that. Uh, so that's for the different weeks. You also have the lectures for that week. They're all pre-recorded. They're on YouTube. You can either watch them directly in here. So as we, or if you click on the title, it'll take you to the YouTube page Let where you can see jump it off, jump into it. a little bit bigger. Um, as you can see, I had less hair at the time. Uh, quarantine life has been growing out my hair. The, so these are the lectures. They're anywhere between 5 and 15 minutes each. And so that's basically the home page, which is the same as the modules page here. Um, if I put, make any announcements, they're going to show up here. Um, it's really important that you check on those. Uh, if you don't have it connected to your email or it's not going to your email, make sure you check on that because it should be going through. The syllabus tab here, it's going to have the different assignments and when they're due. And the only thing to note here is that for the voice thread assignments, you have, you know, the due dates of Sunday. But as I mentioned, you're to make a post by um, Monday for them. So your first post by Monday, sorry, not Sunday, the Friday dates. 
Uh, so you make your first, first post by Monday, second post by Friday. You go to the assignments. It'll have the different um, assignments that you can get to. So you can either get to them by the home page or modules, or you can just go here to see them. Quizzes is the same thing. Um, your grades will show here. Um, and so forth. This back up here. So that's really it. Um, that is the course. Um, again, the biggest thing with this course is if you have any questions, make sure you reach out and ask. Um, set up a time to you know, just send me an email or set up a time for a Zoom meeting. And, you know, I can hopefully talk through any questions or concerns you may have. Um, if you have any questions, again, make sure you reach out. And if not, let's, I well, hope you have a great semester.